forgot to do my intro. stop number one somewhere in Arkansas um, and uh, we'll see if Desi's bike starts if not we're gonna have to jump start it so where are we at Hardy, Hardy? we're in Hardy Arkansas there we go it's just a clicking all right shut the key off let me grab my starter my starter all right turn your key on see if I can do this while videoing it Key on. I don't know if I was holding that where you could see it, but there you go. Let's say you start a V rod <laughs> with a wrench. All right, lunch break is over. McDonald's. The food sucks, but Angie really likes their mocha frappe. So Angie got a mocha frappe. Oh yeah, Angie dumped her bike at we pulled into this little cafe and there was gravel and a hump and she slipped and dropped the bike over now we have matching we have matching highway pegs because I dropped mine on route 66 and broke the highway peg off she just dropped hers and broke the highway peg off they both broke in the exact same spot so um, the left side of our bikes are all matchy matchy anyway we've got uh, a few hours left to go here. Let's see. It says um, It shut off from for some reason oh, Goodness, all right, we have five hours left. It's 346 miles So we've got a just a couple hundred down and a few hundred more to go. We're gonna fill up and hit the road We'll see you down the road come outside before it got too dark um, we're at our friends Chuck and Chilas 
Um, some of their friends are over from Germany, um, our friends too. Um, we've uh, known them for a few years. They haven't been here in a few years because the whole COVID thing and all. So it's great that they're back in the States. In fact, a, a few years ago, like we were riding somewhere and there was a bike sitting alongside the highway and we thought they were broke down. So we pulled over and it was, a, it was actually, um, yeah, uh, great couple. They actually made supper. We're, we're having spaghetti. I'm super excited. It's always nice to eat at home or at some home rather than going out to eat because we go out to eat a lot, a lot. Anyway, we're here. We got a little over 600 miles tomorrow and we will be home. Uh, I think we're all looking forward to that. Uh, I think I told you earlier, Angie dropped her bike in a parking lot. Um, she tweaked her back. So her back's hurting her pretty bad. So hopefully, I think they have a hot tub. Maybe we'll get her in the hot tub, get her limbered up uh, and get her feeling better. Uh, and then of course, you know, the V-Rod's got its issues, but the whole jumping across the solenoid is working. Uh, so we'll get home with that. That's no problem. Uh, knock on wood, there's none around here. Silver's doing good. Um, her bike did break off. Uh, as you saw in the video, it broke um, her highway peg. Uh, not a big deal, right? All that stuff's easily replaceable. She wanted new um, crash bars, engine, engine guards anyway. So um, that's that. This is probably gonna be a pretty short video because I'm tired, the girls are tired, and um, it's time to eat. So I'm gonna go have some spaghetti and we will see you guys tomorrow for the rest of the trip on in to um, Florida. Oh, by the way, so we're cruising out of Birmingham um, and uh, we're doing, I don't know, 80-ish. Uh, and there's a guy comes flying up on a motorcycle. It looks like, when I got to see it, it looked like a sportster with high apes and he got the death wobble. Um, two lanes over from us and I thought for sure he was a goner. But he saved it. Um, but that is, you know, you gotta be careful. When your will is uh, more than your skill, bad things can happen. So um, <laughs> make sure you have the skill level to match your will to push a bike um, or it can end really badly. Anywho, good night, I guess, good morning. We'll see you tomorrow.